The Making of a Mogul, Donald Trump's Early Life and Business Beginnings. Donald John Trump was born in Queens, New York in 1946. His father, Fred Trump, was a successful real estate developer. Donald learned the ropes of the business from his father. He attended the New York Military Academy as a teenager. Trump then went on to study at Fordham University and the Wharton School of the University of Pennsylvania. After graduating from college in 1968, Trump joined his father's company. He worked on projects in Brooklyn and Queens. Trump quickly proved himself to be a shrewd businessman. He had a knack for making deals and a keen eye for opportunity. In 1971, Trump took charge of his father's company. He renamed it the Trump Organization. Trump shifted the company's focus to Manhattan. He saw great potential in the borough's then struggling real estate market. Building an empire Trump's rise in real estate. Trump's first major project in Manhattan was the renovation of the Commodore Hotel. He transformed the aging hotel into the Grand Hyatt. The project was a huge success. It established Trump as a major player in the New York City real estate world. Throughout the 1980s, Trump continued to develop properties in Manhattan. He built Trump Tower, Trump Plaza, and other high-profile buildings. Trump's name became synonymous with luxury and success. His buildings reshaped the city's skyline. Trump also expanded into other businesses. He purchased casinos in Atlantic City, New Jersey. He launched his own airline, Trump Shuttle. Trump even bought the New Jersey Generals, a team in the United States Football League. However, not all of Trump's ventures were successful. Some of his businesses, like the casinos and the airline, struggled financially. Trump's lavish spending habits and risky business decisions led to mounting debts. The art of the deal, Trump's business acumen and controversies. Despite facing financial setbacks, Trump maintained his public image as a successful businessman. He wrote the best-selling book, the Art of the Deal. In it, he shared his business philosophies and strategies. Trump became a celebrity entrepreneur, appearing on television shows and magazine covers. However, Trump's business practices also drew criticism. Some accused him of using unethical tactics to get ahead. There were allegations of discrimination against minority tenants in some of his properties. Trump faced lawsuits and controversies throughout his business career. Nevertheless, Trump remained a prominent figure in the business world. He continued to develop properties and invest in new ventures. His wealth and fame grew, solidifying his status as an American icon. From boardroom to politics, Trump's entry into the political arena. Trump's interest in politics began long before his presidential run. He flirted with the idea of running for office in previous years. Trump often expressed his opinions on political issues. He was a vocal critic of politicians he deemed ineffective. In the early 2010s, Trump became a leading proponent of the Bertha conspiracy theory. This theory falsely claimed that President Barack Obama was not born in the United States. Trump's questioning of Obama's legitimacy fueled his rise in conservative political circles. Trump's foray into politics coincided with his growing dissatisfaction with the political establishment. He believed that the country was headed in the wrong direction. Trump felt that he was the only one who could fix it. Section 5, Trump's Ascent, the 2016 presidential campaign. In June 2015, Trump formally announced his candidacy for President of the United States. His announcement was met with a mix of amusement and skepticism from the political establishment. Few took his candidacy seriously at first. However, Trump's campaign quickly gained momentum. He tapped into a deep well of anger and frustration among voters. Many Americans felt left behind by globalization and economic changes. They were disillusioned with traditional politicians. Trump's campaign rallies were unlike anything seen before. They were raucous events filled with passionate supporters Trump's speeches were often inflammatory and divisive. He made bold promises to make America great again. Trump's message resonated with a large segment of the population. He won the Republican nomination, defeating a crowded field of experienced politicians. His victory shocked the political establishment.
Section 6, A Nation Divided, Trump's Victory and the Aftermath. The 2016 presidential election was one of the most contentious in American history. Trump's opponent, Hillary Clinton, was a former Secretary of State and First Lady. She was considered the heavy favorite to win. The campaign was bitter and divisive. Both candidates traded personal attacks and accusations. The media coverage was relentless, further polarizing the electorate. On election day, Trump defied the polls and won a stunning victory. He captured key swing states and secured enough electoral votes to become the 45th president of the United States. Trump's victory sent shockwaves across the country and around the world. It exposed deep divisions in American society. His supporters celebrated his win as a victory for the common man. His opponents were devastated fearing the unknown consequences of his presidency. Section 7, the Trump presidency policies, controversies and legacy. Donald Trump's presidency was marked by a series of policy changes, controversies and a constant stream of news. He implemented tax cuts, appointed conservative judges to the Supreme Court and pursued an America first agenda on trade and foreign policy. Trump's presidency was also characterized by frequent scandals, investigations, and a highly polarized political climate. He faced accusations of obstruction of justice, abuse of power, and emoluments violations. Trump's rhetoric and actions often sparked outrage and protests. The COVID-19 pandemic presented an unprecedented challenge during Trump's presidency. His handling of the pandemic drew criticism from some quarters. The pandemic also had a significant impact on the economy. Despite the controversies, Trump maintained a loyal base of support throughout his presidency. His supporters admired his unconventional style and his willingness to challenge the status quo. Section 8, Beyond the White House, Trump's continuing influence, Donald Trump's presidency ended on January 20th, 2021, when Joe Biden was sworn in as the 46th president of the United States. However, Trump's influence on American politics and society continues. Trump remains a popular figure among Republican voters. He has hinted at a possible run for president again in 2024. His endorsement is highly sought after by Republican candidates. Trump's legacy is complex and will be debated for years to come. His supporters believe that he was a transformative president who challenged the establishment and put America first. His critics argue that he was a divisive figure who damaged American democracy. Regardless of one's opinion of him, there is no doubt that Donald Trump has left an indelible mark on American history.